from Bay News 9, the latest on the day's top stories, county by county coverage. This is your evening news weather now. Welcome back. A Pinellas County roofing company is giving back to someone who served years for his country. Bay News 9's Randy Nissenbaum has more on the No Roof Left Behind program. It's in tonight's special assignment. Joe Lyles is looking at a picture of when he served in the Army in 1975. I would support my country to help defend the freedom. But now, years later, it's Joe that needs support. Working full-time as a janitor, he barely made enough to pay his bills. And the home he spent 15 years in desperately needed a new roof. It was overwhelming to me that I was going to end up losing my home. Joe says he was going to have to live in this, his two-seater truck, because he couldn't afford his homeowner's insurance with the roof the way it was. So his family nominated him for the charity No Roof Left Behind, and he won. <laughs> Crews from Aries Roofing Services and other local companies spent their day hammering and putting in nails to give Joe a sturdy roof over his head. We tore off a tile roof, there's a flat deck in the back, and we're putting a tile roof back at the first of the week. It looks fantastic. My house already looks like a brand new home. Joe says he's never felt so loved. Kate expressed my gratitude for, for the community coming together. A roof no longer left behind, and to Joe, will be cherished forever. I am very emotional. In Largo, Randy Nissenbaum, Bay News 9. Aries Roofing estimates that it would have cost Joe about $15,000 to fix his roof on his own. If you'd like to nominate someone for the No Roof Left Behind program, visit our website, baynews9.com.